Now you can also buy our favorite toys from www.puntunkids.com. Link is in the description. Gattu and Chinky were playing with other children in the garden. Goody was coming there with some plates from her home. Hey Goody, what have you brought? Mummy has sent some snacks for all of you. Today is Mummy Papa's anniversary. Wow, it is a pastry. Yes, and it also has chips and samosas for you guys. Enjoy all of you. But Goody, what have you done for Mummy Papa? I went to the market with Bablu Uncle and bought a sari for Mummy and a matching kurta for Papa. They are wearing it now. After some time, come to my home. We will dance. I have to go now. Chinky suddenly turns to Gattu and says, "Do you remember Gattu? Our mummy papa's anniversary is in next week. We should start the preparation now. We should not remember it at the last minute like Gutti." Yes, you are right, Chinky. But what are we going to do? We should try something new this time. Like what? Wait. Let's play for now. Afterward, we will think about it together. <laughs> okay, all right. After some time, Mummy calls them for dinner. Papa had returned from the office. They were having dinner at the dinner table. Aren't you going to the party at Rakesh's house? I didn't get time for it. First home, then office, then electricity department office. I think my whole life is going to be like this. And you also had to go to the baby shower at Sarita's home, right? Did you go? How could I go? Both of them come from the school in the afternoon. Then there is lunch and Gattu Chinki's homework. I don't get time at all. It's been so long since I met my college friends. Both become sad and start eating. Gattu Chinki were watching this. They went to their room, and they decide to invite Mummy Papa's friends to their surprise party. But how are we going to do that? We have to take help from Grandma and Grandpa. She will find everyone's number from their phone and call them. Wow! Mummy will be so happy to meet all her friends. Yes, just like I feel when I meet Bunty. Finally, today was the anniversary. Mummy and Papa were sitting home when suddenly all of their friends came there and they said, Surprise! Surprise! Rakesh, Sahil, Suresh, you all. Oh my God! Kavita, Simran, Sudha, you guys are here. <laughs> How did it happen? What's going on? Your mother-in-law called me. It's been so long since I met you, so I couldn't stop myself from coming here. Yes, I couldn't meet you because of the workload for so long. After saying this, he gives Papa a tight hug. Then an uncle living in their society also comes there with a person carrying food items. What is this? Who told you to do this? Gattu and Chinky. They told me about the surprise party. They also told me how many people they are expecting. So I have brought food for everyone. Mummy became emotional after seeing all this, and with love she asked Gattu and Chinky. You planned all of this for us? Yes, dear. You have no idea what you have done for us today. I feel like I'm back at school and college days. Happy anniversary, Papa. Happy anniversary, Mummy. I hope you're happy. That day you were missing your old friends at the dinner table, so we planned this on the same day. Yes, the credit goes to both the kids and chairman, who helped me by ordering this food. We wouldn't be able to give you a surprise party otherwise. Then Rakesh comes and says, "They are so lovely, kids. God bless you, kids." Are you going to stand here? You guys enjoy dancing and singing. Today, Gattu Chinki and I will manage the kitchen. Yes, Grandma. And don't you dare to enter the kitchen today, Mummy. Gattu and Chinki were serving food on the plates for everyone with Grandma. Chinki was keeping gulab jamun in small bowls, and Gattu was carrying all these plates to the dining table. Chinki. Please count all the bowls, spoons, and plates one more time, so they won't fall short. And yes, kids, we will open the ice cream pack in the end. Tell me when everyone take their seats. I will heat the biryani in two minutes. Okay, Grandma. Everyone was dancing in the living room. 
Sudha, do you remember Falguni Pathak's song? We used to dance on them. <laughs> the song started playing in the living room, and Mummy started dancing happily with her friends. Do you remember we both danced on this song in the annual function of the college? So, what are you guys waiting for today? Let's have a dance competition. Yes, mummy. Yes, mummy. You should dance with auntie. I will make a video. But play some different song this time. Papa played the song again. When the song started playing, mummy and Simran started dancing with perfect rhythm and tune. Then they both happily hug each other. Thank you for coming, Simran. My pleasure. Grandma comes there and tells everyone to have dinner. Everyone took food to their plates. The dinner is very delicious, Auntie. You can thank these kids for all this. It was their plan. I just helped them a little bit. Mummy got emotional hearing this. After a while, everyone left. Gattu and Chinki were helping their grandma in cleaning the kitchen. Thank you, Grandma. Papa and Mummy looked so happy today. You are right, kids. After so many years, I saw my daughter-in-law dancing. From a distance, Papa and Mummy were happily watching them talk. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you one thing. What? Happy anniversary. Thanks for coming in my life. Happy anniversary to you too. Got to Chinky also come running and hug them. Happy, Happy anniversary, anniversary mummy papa. papa. We love, love you. Love you too, dear. All four were hugging each other and grandmother was happily watching them from a distance. If you are liking our videos, then like them, comment them and subscribe.